first target. It's an 11, 11, 12, but uh, it's also a little bit scratchy. Okay, that's probably it. Some trash. Okay. Okay guys, not a bad sandy target. A uh, solid nine. <clears throat> oh okay, it's uh some copper. Okay guys, looks like a ring. First ring for the day. Okay, see a uh, copper coming through, just a junker. Okay, let's get going. Meh. Okay. Uh, uh, this is not a bad sounding 13 target. Uh, pretty sure I missed that one. Rock is actually the target. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's a spoon. Okay. It's quite a strong spoon. There's a stamp on there. It says UT Car US. I wonder if it has anything to do with the war. Okay, I just uh, hunted along the cart and yeah, not too much action today. And most of those iron targets have disappeared. So the, um, yeah, the sand's washed in. Anyhow, uh, it's time to look for somewhere different. I'm gonna head down south and uh, see what's going on down here. Stand by. Just stuck this uh, 20 target. Okay, it's a watch with no face. Oh, okay, it's a citizen watch. Yeah, it's well and truly flooded. Okay, guys, let's keep going. Meh. Hello Kitty, right in on a dolphin. <laughs> Alright, let's get going. Okay, guys, I'm trying to uh, pinpoint this 12. Uh, it's in a bad spot amongst the wash. I might have got it actually. Oh, I see an earring. It looks gold, but I don't believe it is. I uh, gotta be careful of this actually. Let me do it out on the water. <laughs> Oh no, this is bling guys. It was probably gold plated at one stage, but yeah, I can see the copper between there. Uh, not sure what this is. This one looks like, um, hang on. Okay, that looks like uh, Buddha. That could be silver. The connection is weird. Pull tab, it's just uh, like a coat hanger. There's some bling or trash. Some bling. It's a shiny coin. Gold button. Uh, it could be a battery. Uh, it's just a button. Simple. Pull tab. I just dug an 18 target out of here. And I can see something that looks gold and shining in the sand, but. It's a little bit high. Ah. Okay. False alarm. It's like a bling heart. <laughs> okay. Meh. 30 to 34. It's quite heavy. Oh. <laughs> what the hell is that? Okay. 
Don't know what that is, but I'm gonna throw it up. I think I'm back on the gold. I just dug a 13 target. <laughs> this is looking good. Oh, nice. Okay, I can see a stamp. I think it says 750. <laughs> awesome. Actually, you know what? I think that stone could be real. It doesn't look like glass. Oh, awesome, guys. Okay, um... Yeah, 13, 14. Nice, I didn't think I was going to find any gold today. Uh, I'm not in a, a patch that was producing anything exciting. I didn't even get any rings, so... <laughs> I will take this. Hey guys, 11-12 target. Not too far from the, um, the gold ring. I found that over a little bit deeper, actually. Uh. Okay, it's out. Oh no. That was not good. Ah. Okay, I found it. Okay. It's a... It's a junk ring. Let me try and rinse it. Yeah. I can see the brass or copper shining through. Okay, I'm liking this patch. Meh. Okay guys, got a low target here. I quickly dig this and... Uh, I think I got it. I'm on a decent patch guys. Okay. What is this? Oh wow. <laughs> this could be gold guys. Looks like old gold. It's not very shiny though. It could just be um low carrot old gold okay cool this day is turning around I was gonna stop but I keep getting uh, energy boosts <laughs> let's get going meh guys more gold in the scoop I actually lost this target and almost quit on it because uh, I was getting smashed for the waves but uh Sorry guys, I can't talk and look. <laughs> Trying to find the stamp, but... Yeah, okay. I'll uh, check this out more when I get back, guys. I don't want to drop it in the water. <laughs> cool. That's possibly three golds now. I keep wanting to go home, but the gold keeps giving me energy. <laughs> so I'm going to keep going. Okay guys, so I'm done for today. I'm exhausted. Uh, I spent most of my time hunting in the wash and um, yeah, you drain a lot of energy doing that. Uh, there's a lot of resistance on the um, detector and arm and trying to uh, retrieve targets is not easy. But um, I had not a bad day, guys. <laughs> I Actually, I wasn't expecting to find any gold. Um, when I went to my old um, honey hole and there's already been five guys just smashing that now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delay my videos by at least a week um, because I spend a lot of time, um, I drive up and down on the motorbike looking for uh, places to hunt and you know it could take me seven hours of um, zigzagging to find these uh, good patches. Anyway guys, um, yeah, not a bad hunt. I will show you the gold in the wrap up. 
All right guys, so welcome to the wrap up. Uh, this hunt was actually done about three weeks ago and I've only just got the chance to do the video editing and uh, do the wrap up. So my apologies for the delay. Um, let's quickly get through this. So uh, starting off with the trash. Um, I did find a few keys today. Uh, some of the light stuff is coming back now guys. The beach is beginning to sand in and the wet season is almost over. So uh, we've got to wait for the fresh drop season to kick in. I uh, found a few bullets, um, some trash, a few bolts, there's a zip pull. Uh, I also found this spoon, and I'm not sure if this one's related to the Vietnam War or not, but it says Utica USA. Uh, that's a stamp on the spoon. It's quite a big, heavy spoon, so uh, kind of cool. Um, then I moved to another area. The, so I found this stuff in the honey hole, and then I moved to a different area. And I found this uh, watch, which is totally flooded, but this one is a citizen watch and just a little bit of bling, guys. And targets of interest were this Buddha. So this is a Buddha pendant or Buddha, Buddha, Buddha. Uh, this one is not made out of any stone or ceramic. This is actually wood. I think it's wood or cork. It's kind of hard to be cork, so most likely wood. And the casing is silver. Uh, the rest of it is not silver, it's like stainless, but um, yeah, interesting find. And okay, in the video, guys, I mentioned I found some old gold, and this was a low target, it was registering as a four from memory, but um, yeah, this is not gold, this is um, most likely plated, it kind of fell, uh, fell apart. Uh, also found two junk rings, which yeah, <laughs> these are just junk. Uh, so let's get to the good stuff. Um, first gold ring of that hunt was uh, this beautiful jade, uh, green jade, uh, 750, so 18 karat gold. Um, yeah, guys, this ring is, I don't know, probably one of the best rings I found. Uh, there's no erosion, uh, no scratches, no stains. This is a beautiful ring. Uh, this one weighs in at 7.06, 7.05. Uh, really happy with this find, guys. Um, like I said, probably the best ring I found. Very beautiful. And the second gold ring of this hunt was uh, this little ring. It looks small and it's actually quite heavy for its size. So this one's 3.72 and this one is stamped 680. So I'm guessing this is like 68% uh, gold. And you can see a little bit of um, crustacean or erosion. It's probably where the um, ring has been resized and they've um, soldered the um, they've soldered the joint sorry um, but yeah still a cool find uh, I did go on another hunt not long after this uh, I think a few days after and I didn't find anything good guys so uh, just a couple of coins and the rest was just trash so yeah unfortunately the storm season is over and the beach is sort of going back to its old ways where you start seeing the pool tabs again uh, anyway guys, I am really not sure when I'm gonna have my next video because um, As you all know, I only upload when I find something interesting. Uh, I will still be hunting, but Yeah, if I don't find anything good, I'm not gonna make a video. I'm not gonna just make a video of me digging up trash It gets boring quick Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the hunt. If you did, uh, please give me a thumbs up. It helps with the uh, YouTube's algorithm and I shall see you on the next one <laughs>